gentlemen before them, Sir Marcus Panarius Trocadarius. Your Majesties, I wish to beg a boon. Ask it if it be a right to proper thing within our powers, it shall be yours. As my squire Roberto has now sat vigil for these many weeks, I ask that he be elevated to the order of the chivalry today. Their Majesties call before them. Roberto Jose Alfonso Cayetano de San Fernando Toledo Ruiz y Escalante. In thy strength, O Majesties, the just man shall exult, and in thy benediction he shall rejoice exceedingly. Lo, one such man before you emerges, Roberto Jose Alfonso Caetano de San Fernando Toledo Ruiz de Escalante. I present to thee this supplication and thanksgiving, that thy spirit and comfort may be centered down upon him, strengthening and fitting him for this service of knighthood, and count him worthy to make known without condemnation the word of your will of ascendance. Brutus who taught him and sent him among the hard path of prowess, and entrusted him, then taught him, and guided him to lands distant and near for the path of justice and succor. Your Majesties of the Dragon Kingdom, you're vigilant, ready to receive thy rare and sublime elevation to your most noble order of the chivalry. to Roberto's nobility. Your Majesty, yes. we've been asked to speak on behalf of Roberto. Uh, I once nearly killed Roberto with a tree. <laughs> <laughs> now, I know this is an odd way to start talking about someone's character. But such was his character that he never again mentioned the fact that I nearly killed him with a tree. <laughs> now, it was his fault that he ran the wrong way the first time, but to his credit, he did correct. I have never met a man who had such heart and character and soul. I have never met a soul that carried so much weight when they spoke, who gave so much of themselves. Majesty, I commend this man to you in all ways. Majesty, I have never attempted to kill a bird over the tree. <laughs> 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 Is there 
a companion of the Laurel that will attest to the Burrow's <coughs> skill in arts and science. science. Assembled noble guests. I am Laureate Strides in Los Companion of the Pelican, who will attest to Roberto's service. I am Madre Beth Silas Stone, Baroness of your court, and I will speak to Roberto's service. Long has service been a quiet element of our society, weaving its way into every aspect of our fun. So one would think that Roberto, my jaunty squire, with <laughs> wouldn't necessarily fit that mold of being quiet and being behind the scenes. But to tell you the truth, that's what I admire about his service. His loud, unrelenting commitment to helping the society and our mighty kingdom learn about its proud diversity. I appreciate his willingness to have and facilitate hard conversations but very, very needed conversations about equity. I am very proud of how his service continues to grow as he continues his journey. And while he will always be my eating squire, <laughs> I know he will continue to serve the kingdom as best he can. We need more service like Roberto's. And I cannot commend him enough to your majesties. He is my peer. Thank you. Woo! Their majesties now call before them their order of the chivalry. Noble sirs, is it your judgment that Roberto Jose Alfonso Cayetano de San Fernando Toledo Ruiz y Escalante is worthy to be numbered among our chivalry and prowess, loyalty and courtesy? Aye! Roberto, right mindful of your prowess on the field and responsive to the wishes of your peers, we are reminded to make you Know that to wear the belt and chain of a knight is to hold the sacred trust, that the obligations of knighthood will demand your efforts every moment. Knights of the society must be respectful of all religions, never offending the faith of another. A knight must respect all those who are weak or defenseless. Whether because of age, infirmity, poverty, or vow, and be steadfast in defending them. A knight must love their kingdom and fulfill most faithfully their feudal duties to their baron and their sovereign. Their word must be dependable beyond doubt question. They must never flee from the face of their foes. They must be generous to all. And always and everywhere, they must be champion of the rights of the kingdom. The laws of the society and customs of the kingdom require that a knight be proud. As you have demonstrated, you are upon, upon the field. That a knight be courteous as you have shown yourself to be, as these nobles attest. <coughs> and tonight, be loyal to their kingdom and the society. You 
you still desire to be a knight? Is there a belt? This belt was placed around the waist of my knight. She locked my key. It was placed around my waist when I became a knight. And now it shall be used to knight my squire. Is there a sword? <laughs> Bear your sword with strength, so disposing your heart to goodness that you never use it to injure anyone unjustly. Always use it to defend the just and the right. Is there a chain? There is a match. Same story as the belt. <laughs> <laughs> Spurs. Where are you, Maxie? These are the open spurs. First worn by Ike Brander, then Finn, Edmund, Augmundus, William, David, Oberon, Michael, Ephraim, Vernon, William, Gilon, Bonner, Rand, Patrick, Lothar, Nikolai, Palomar, Ismail. Richard, Randolph, Aloric, Robert, Thomas, Alvaric, Thorfinn, Uller, Vitus, Baldwin, Stodd, Dimitri, Nigel, Dorkin, Ruder, Ragnar, Axel, Kellen, Rector, Gunnar, Cadigan, Farthen, Silverthorn, Echo, Arter, Morris, Callum, Crispin, Ingram, Nicholas, Wolfer, Odo, Allrecker, Bruce, Christian, Winpang, Jamie, McKenna, Cedric, Thorin, Gephardt, Braun, Angus, Geary, Magnus, Marcus, Corbus, Wolfric, Ivan, Harold, Timothy, Sirius, Onan, Rangi, Sibrid, Angus, and now, Roberto, Jose, Alfonso, Gaetano, Pesciuto, Sledo, Grief, Yes, Blanca. That's going to be Roberto. Where are these spurs? shall never forget to be your liege lord. Rewarding fealty with love, valor with honor, and good breaking with vengeance. In remembrance of both given and received. In remembrance of your lineage and obligations. Thou be good night. Bear this love and no others.
Realm, your newest knight of this society, Roberto. <laughs> Christoph Kultburn and Katrin Bronwyn of Gloucester. <laughs> 